With these can-do videos, you'll see real-life situations where you have to introduce yourself, talk about your family, or give your contact information. So, by the end, you can do them yourself in French. This video is a small portion of our can-do course. To get the full course, including translations, grammar tools, and assessment tests, click the link in the description. Welcome to Can Do French by FrenchPod101.com. Bonjour à tous, je suis Lia Mercier. Hi everyone, I'm Lia Mercier. In this lesson, you learn how to use parting greetings. This is Karen Lee, and she's talking with her former homestay mother, Mathilde Martin. As Karen says goodbye, her children join her in saying goodnight. Focus on the way each person says goodbye. À bientôt. Bonne nuit. Repose-toi bien. À plus tard. Once more with the English translation. À bientôt. See you soon. Bonne nuit. Good night. Repose-toi bien. Rest well. À plus tard. See you later. Wondering how you can master these conversations even faster? Here's how. 1. Read along. You get the lesson conversation and translations inside our dialogue tool so that you see each word as you hear it and understand it all. 2. Practice speaking. By shadowing what you hear, you can also record and compare yourself with native speakers with our voice recording tools. And 3. Take our assessment tests and see how much you remember. These tools are part of our Can Do course. Just click the link in the description to get them. Let's take a closer look at each of these expressions. First, do you remember how Karen says, See you soon. À bientôt. This starts with the preposition, à, which means something like until, in this context. À. À. Next is, Bientôt. Soon. Bientôt. Bientôt. Altogether. À bientôt. Means something like until soon, but it translates as see you soon. À bientôt. À bientôt. Is fairly informal, which indicates a close relationship between Karen and Mathilde Martin, her former homestay mother. Do you remember how Sasha says, Good night. Bonne nuit. Good night. Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Literally means good night. Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. You use Bonne nuit. Good night when someone is about to go to bed and often when you don't plan on seeing someone again that night. Do you remember how Ben says, rest well? Repose-toi bien. Rest well. Repose-toi bien. First is, repose-toi. Meaning rest. Repose-toi. Repose-toi. Note. Repose-toi. Is from the verb. Se reposer. Meaning to rest. Se reposer. Next is. Bien. Well. Bien. Bien. Together. Repose-toi bien. Rest well. 
Repose-toi bien. Note, this is appropriate for informal situations. Do you remember how Mathilde says, see you later? À plus tard. See you later. À plus tard. This starts with the preposition à, which means something like until in this case. À. À. After this is plus. More. Plus. Plus. Pronunciation note. In most cases, you pronounce the S sound in plus. However, in this specific expression, you don't have to. Tard means late. Tard. Tard. Altogether, it's à plus tard. This means something like until later, but translates as see you later. À plus tard. Mathilde uses this to say goodbye to everyone. Even though it is slightly formal, it's a friendly way to say goodbye. With friends, French people tend to shorten à plus tard to à plus. In this case, you must pronounce the S. À plus. See you. À plus. À plus. Let's look at the parting greetings once more. Listen and repeat, or speak along with me. À bientôt. À bientôt. Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. À plus tard. À plus tard. Repose-toi bien. Repose-toi bien. À plus. À plus. Salut. Salut. Au revoir. Au revoir. Did you notice the last two parting expressions I used? Salut. Au revoir. Wondering how you can master these conversations even faster? Here's how. 1. Read along. You get the lesson conversation and translations inside our dialogue tool so that you see each word as you hear it and understand it all. 2. Practice speaking. By shadowing what you hear, you can also record and compare yourself with native speakers with our voice recording tools. And three, take our assessment tests and see how much you remember. These tools are part of our Can Do course. Just click the link in the description to get them. The first expression used was... Salut. Hi. Salut. Salut. In informal situations, you can use the greeting Salut. Salut is a common greeting in French. However, it's only suitable for informal situations, such as when saying goodbye to friends. Note Salut is also a common greeting translating as hi or hello. Because of this, you can use Salut both as a greeting and a parting expression. The second parting greeting Au revoir means see you. Au revoir. Au revoir. It's a formal greeting you can use when you're sure you're going to meet the other person again. You can use it to address one or more people. Au revoir. Let's review. Respond to the prompts by speaking aloud. Then, repeat after me, focusing on pronunciation. Ready? Do you remember how to say, see you soon? 
À bientôt. À bientôt. And how to say good night? Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Do you remember how to say rest well? Repose-toi bien. Repose-toi bien. And how to say see you later? À plus tard. À plus tard. Do you remember how to say see you? Hint is the shortened version of à plus tard. À plus. À plus. Let's practice. Imagine you're Mark Lee and you're talking to Mathilde. Respond by saying good night. Ready? Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Listen again and repeat. Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Let's try another. Imagine you're Sasha Lee and you're finishing class. Respond by saying, see you soon. Ready? A plus. A bientôt. Listen again and repeat. A bientôt. A bientôt. Let's try one more. Imagine you're Ben Lee and you're finishing coffee with your college friend, Justine. Respond by saying, see you. Ready? À plus tard. À plus. Listen again and repeat. À plus. À plus. This is the end of this lesson. Now, here's what you can do to cement this conversation in your head. Review the conversation with our dialogue tool and lesson transcripts. Study the key words and phrases with our spaced repetition flashcards. Review the key grammar and cultural tips inside the lesson notes. And test yourself with our assessment tests. So click the link in the description right now and sign up for your free lifetime account to access our CanDo course. Now you know how to use basic parting greetings in French. That's all there is to it. Keep practicing and move on to the next lesson.